I have considerable sympathy with the noble lady Baroness Thornton on the use of the urgent powers procedures in relation to these regulations. But I want to deal with some substantive issues around the regulations and the common travel area. And I'd be grateful if the minister, when he comes to reply, could set out clearly how international visitors from high-risk countries are monitored after crossing from the Irish Republic into Northern Ireland and then into England or other parts of the United Kingdom, because there is a major loophole at present. There's been an ongoing problem with getting the necessary information and data from the Irish Republic authorities. The Northern Ireland Executive and our local health minister have been calling for this information to be shared from passenger locator forms in the Irish Republic. So far, little or no progress. It's absolutely imperative, my lords, that the Dublin government acts on this. Otherwise, there's a massive problem. It should have done so months ago, and we were assured that it would happen, but it hasn't yet occurred. So passenger locator, locator form information needs to be shared between the Irish Republic and the UK authorities, especially in Northern Ireland. Now, this has been raised bilaterally, as I said, but it needs to be resolved as a matter of urgency. Arguments have made, been made concerning problems with data sharing and that legislation may be needed, but we can't afford to waste any more time given the urgency of the problems concerning the spread of COVID through international travel. Um, can we have a collaborative approach? Will the Minister urge um, information sharing with the Irish Republic and vice versa? And can he speak to colleagues in government to ensure that support is given to the Northern Ireland Executive in time, trying to extract this vital information? Information and data is shared very regularly on a whole host of issues to do with security and immigration issues pertaining to the common travel area, and it needs to happen in relation to COVID. It's a matter of really, it, is, it, it really is a matter of life and death.